<laughs> You're, you talked to us about the long flight yesterday. We saw you when you uh, traveled through Germany. How do you feel physically, and is your head sort of spinning from the last 48, 72 hours, week or so? I mean, of course, head is spinning. You know, it's a uh, jet lag. You know, six hour difference. But um, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to be back in Miami. Um, I have more than enough energy. I don't think so. That's going to be a problem. Um, um, I can't wait to start training camp. Um, you know, I only play nine games there. It's, it, it was not like that. I went through the whole season. So, um, but um, I, I feel like that um, even you know to win a European Championship give ex give me extra motivation, e extra energy that I'm gonna have a good season. The team finished so strong last season. Um, do you bring that with you as you start training camp, or is it a clean slate to start over? Um, you bring a little bit, you know, you need to bring a little bit with us, but at the same time, you, we need to be humble and we need to work hard because, um, you know, we, we know it's not going to be overnight that the same chemistry is going to be right away on the court. You, you need to go through motions, um, through practices that all the players are on the, on the same page. And, um, you know, we feel like that this year we have a little bit advantage because uh, we're not starting from zero. You know, we know everybody knows each other off the court, on the court. Um, we are good friends, and um, you know, hopefully, hopefully, we're gonna start playing well as as, as soon as possible. So this is what we get this year, the uh, bearded dragon. Uh, no, that, that's for my grandfather. That's for my grandfather. Yeah, um, you know, before European Championship, he passed away, and in our culture, is that you don't play for 40 days. Yeah. I still have a couple of days, but uh, yeah, I'm thinking too, just to keep it. I know it doesn't look good, but um, you know, we won a championship, so why not? <laughs> uh, Goran, your thoughts on the Warriors and Trump and everything that's inspired this weekend? Uh, yeah, first of all, you know, I would like to be in that position, you know, to win a NBA NBA ring, and when that time comes, we'll see. You know, um, I'm not really a political guy, I, you know, I'm just a uh, I'm just a guy who plays basketball, but um, if that's gonna come, we'll see. What are your thoughts on you know D Wade buyout and possibly you know the shortness, obviously, yeah. Miami Heat, and this is home. Yeah, they the basketball decision as well. So. Yeah, you know, uh, of course uh, we're gonna respect his decision, but um, every team wants to have a Hall of Famer and um, um, All Star player in their team, and hopefully he's gonna come back home. You know, this is his home. He, he played here for about 13 years, and win three championship rings, and um, it's always um, nice to have this kind of player present in the locker room and on the floor. With his experience, he can help a lot to this young team, and um, yeah, hopefully, hopefully he says yes.